Hey, it's Friday. That's right. We're just a couple of days away. If you had forgot to order something for someone for Christmas. Sorry, pal. It's too late. But that's okay. Because today, we're going to discuss It's a Wonderful Life. Don't go anywhere. Previously on the Nerdy Ronin Network. Oh man, happy Friday! That's right, I'm so excited! The week's over with. Whether it's a work week, uh, a fun week, a Christmas week, a Christmas vacation week, whatever it is, it's on its way out. And this weekend is the best. You know why? You know why? Because Christmas is Sunday. First things first, happy birthday, Daxton. Nerdy Daxton, it's his birthday today. So, woohoo! That's exciting. And secondly, Bushido Blues. If you haven't checked out Bushido Blues' channel, you need to do so. If you dig Samurai stuff, man, he has fantastic videos. Merry Christmas, Bushido. Bushido was nice enough to send me a Christmas gift. A super awesome movie, one of his favorites, that I can't wait to review. Such a good gift. I appreciate that, sir. Man, I'm 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 getting fat stacks and it's not even Christmas yet. Woo! Okay. So like and subscribe if you haven't already. If you're watching this and you're not subscribed, what's wrong with you? Please do. What's it hurt? Turn off the notifications, you'll never know. And I'll appreciate you taking part in the Christmas spirit and giving me another subscriber. <laughs> In the description down below are things we love and enjoy here, like coffee. No one pays us, but you might find your new favorite thing there if you take a look. Now, to get in the Christmas spirit, there's a set of movies that everyone seems to agree are the classics that you watch, like A Christmas Story, um, Miracle on 34th Street, Elf. You know, there's just, there's a list now, it's a secret list, but definitely a list. And today, we are going to talk about one of those movies. One of the best. One of the classics. One you can't go through your December without watching. And it's a wonderful life. That's right. 1946, PG, 2 hours and 10 minutes. What else are you guys doing today? You're snowed in if you're like us. And I had to go to the pharmacy in this crap. In my car. It's a small car. In relation to a truck. But I made it okay. Kind of. <laughs> made it home safely. <laughs> this movie. Uh, first things. There's a list of cool things about this movie. First. James Stewart. Jimmy Stewart. You can't not enjoy that man as an actor. He's brilliant. In every single thing he's ever been in, he was brilliant. My favorite is Harvey. And if you've not seen that one, oh, oh, you're making my heart ache. Second thing, Donna Reed is in this movie. She's fantastic as well. And it's directed by Frank Capra. What are you doing? You have to watch... First things... Look, our biggest complaint about movies and stuff, entertainment today, in this part of America, or in, in, in this time frame, is there's no world building. It's just a bunch of messaging. The story is not important, etc., etc. This movie, the first three-fourths of it, is completely world building. It's not the... The first three-fourths of the movie is not the story you're supposed to be watching. It just is bits and pieces of world building. And the final quarter of the movie is the story. That's insane. 
and it works beautifully because by the time you get to the end of the movie or to the last fourth of the movie you are you love these characters you've grown with them you've found them entertaining or despise some of them or and you just you're so like you want to see what's happening it's amazing and no one does this anymore maybe tarantino but for the most part this kind of movie does not exist anymore you could even argue this is not a christmas movie I would argue you're crazy. It takes place at Christmas time. It takes place on Christmas Eve. But it's not a Christmas movie per se. Anyway, this movie, it shows you that no matter how alone or hurt you may be, if you weren't here, people would be changed forever for the worse. You may think nobody cares, but you touch hundreds of lives every day. So if you don't want to count as a Christmas movie, fine, watch it any time of the year. The moral of the story is to be a good person. And an angel earn, earns his wings in this movie. Hmm, so there's that. This movie was way ahead of its time. Oh, it's brilliant. James Stewart and Donna Reed, they just excel so much. And Frank, Frank Capra knew how to really put stress and make it you anxious and, and, and you're worried for these characters and you just you're on the edge of your seat don't watch some weird colorized version black and white's the way to go 1946 it's fantastic you guys i'm so excited the next time i talk to you it'll be the day after christmas i wonder what presents i'm getting this year Maybe coal. I hope not. But we'll find out. I hope every single one of you out there have a brilliant Christmas. A brilliant weekend with family and friends. If you're all alone, that's okay too. You can still be merry and have a good Christmas. Remember, you're never truly alone. There's other people out there just like you. Reach out to somebody at the end of every single one of my videos. is a list of numbers to call if you're feeling lonely or depressed. Or just need someone to speak to. It's all anonymous. You got a number for veterans. You got a number for non-veterans alike. Everyone. So please, if at any point you feel lonely, you feel sad, you feel depressed during this Christmas time or any time. Just fast forward to the end of my video and the numbers are right there. But other than that, please have a wonderful Christmas. Thanks for all you guys do watching and liking my stuff. For Michael the Microphone, Bob Squeaky Chair, and this Christmas loving Grinch. Merry Christmas. And we'll see you on Monday.